Did you lose your data from your external hard drive or from a flash drive? Or maybe you kept something in your partition and it is lost? Well, don't you worry, I got you covered. Hey there guys, how are you all doing? This is your Vbro from TechWeek and today in this video I'll be reviewing a great tool which can recover lost data from your hard drive or from your pen drive. Alright, the software which I'm talking about in this video is AnyRecover by iMyPhone. This application is available for Windows as well as Mac users, so it doesn't matter if you have a Mac or a PC. I would also like to thank iMyPhone team for sponsoring this video and letting me try this great utility. Now let's take a look at some of the key features that AnyRecover brings on the table. Well, you can see right here on their official website that AnyRecover can recover data from a full range of devices, which includes hard drives, USB flash drives, SD cards, SSDs, cameras, etc. It also supports more than 1000 files, 1000 file types, including photos, videos, office documents, archives, and many more. You can also retrieve unlimited data in three steps and anyone can restore lost files on their own. And also guys, the free trial version allows users to test out this function and recover up to eight files for free without any size limit. Well, these are some really bold claims and don't worry, I'll be testing out all these features in this application right in this video itself. But before moving into the testing process, I would like to show you guys something really unfortunate. You know guys, only 1.7% of you are really subscribed to my channel and rest 98.3% of you guys are not subscribed to my channel. So if you really want to support me, please do consider subscribing to my channel as it means the world to me. Okay, so for testing this application, I have a flash drive, all right, with some files. For better testing, I am choosing different types of files, which includes some videos, photos, MP3 files, some compressed files and some document files. Now what I'll be doing here is just format this drive using the default way of formatting, which is just right clicking on the flash drive and choosing format. This ensures a scenario of data loss. All right, so now as the drive is formatted, let's open up any recover and let's search for the drive we want to recover. Okay, so as you can see, this is my drive, which is an 8 gigabyte SanDisk flash drive. Let's select this drive and click on start. Now any recover will scan the whole drive for lost data. This basically takes a bit of time. So what I would suggest you to do is get yourself a coffee or listen to some good chill music. But don't worry, I'll skip this part so that you guys won't be bored by staring at this screen. Okay, so now we are completed and as you can see, it says some files are not found. Please recover the found ones first and then go back to try again. Alright, so let's click on OK. Here you can see there are some folders like photo, video, audio, etc. Let's click on photo and let's take a look at whether my photos are recovered or not. Alright, so as you can see here, the photos are recovered, like one of my photos is recovered. Let's take a look at other files. All right, so it seems my other photo is corrupted and it was not able to recover. All right, we'll keep that thing in mind and let's keep moving forward. Okay, so the video is playing back with no issue as you can see right here. And the same goes to the audio file, it is working. Now let's check out the documents if they are recovered as well. Alright, so as you can see, my Word document file is working. So as the PDF file is working, and that's great. Now let's check my compressed files if it is still corrupted or it's working. Okay, so it says this type of file is not supported. All right, let's check for others. And these are some random files and 
maybe i don't really know from where these files appeared but hey it's still there i'll keep it but yeah like most of the things that i stored inside my flash drive is recovered excluding one of my photo which yeah it's quite a bummer but let me now extract these recovered files and for that let me choose photo video audio documents and archive and click on recover now you just need to specify the location where you want to paste all these recovered files for me i'll choose my desktop as it's pretty easy for me to locate and yeah to work now let's click on ok let's wait for some time okay so we can see here our files are recovered and let's click on ok and let's check whether it has successfully recovered my files. All right, so we got the folders and let's check what is there inside those folders. Okay, so one of my photo has not been recovered. Like I said, as you can see right here and the rest of the files, it seems has been recovered successfully. And that's pretty impressive. All right, guys. So as you saw, we can easily recover lost files using any recover. And now if you're interested in downloading this application, check the description box down below. There you'll find all the download links, both for Windows as well as for Mac. Well, that's pretty much it for this video, guys. If you lost your data and you want a great tool that can recover your files, then you can definitely go ahead and try any recover by iMyPhone. If this video was helpful, do consider liking this video and do click on the subscribe button as it helps me a lot. Alright guys, thanks for watching, have a great day, God bless you all, and I'll be seeing you guys in the next video. And if you do have some queries, you know how to reach me down in the comment box down below. Have a great day, bye.